Hi friends, welcome to Bella Stitchery. No one does holiday paper quite like authentic paper. I just got this Liberty collection in the mail today and I wanted to do a product reveal because I love this paper pad. I've already made tons of projects with it and I've opened it today. This is a new one because I buy two <laughs> every time I order any collection pack because you just hate to run out, especially if there's a print or two that is like a great background print and you end up using it all right away. And then again, you're like, why didn't I or just order more, you know? When in doubt, double it. So this is the Liberty line. They are all double-sided. They are all glorious. And I cannot wait to show you everything that is in store in this collection here. This, okay, I love that Authentique does this. They do this in a couple different ways. First, like I said, it's double-sided. So the, the biggest challenge you're gonna have with this one is like which page to use. Don't worry, there's two. Oh, sigh of relief. Oh, fan yourself out. So this has kind of like a music note. It's called Liberty 8. I actually prefer this side myself, but with this you could actually cut out all your different embellishments, make cards, tags, things like that from this. This one is my favorite because I love pinups, I love retro images, I really love how colorful this page is, and I've already made several cards from these images I will show you in a minute. And on the back is a stripe, which I also love, right? Oh my gosh. Okay, next you'll have stars. Awesome. I love that it's with a beige and blue. I kind of like that. It's kind of more vintage color palette, I feel like. And this has a bunch of words, flags. Gorgeous, right? Checkered. This reminds me of a cozy shirt that you would find at Goodwill. And it is just so soft and threadbare. And a farmer wore it till he was 92. And on the back you have like almost like a tile look. Well, let's get back to this. So cozy, love it. Okay, so you have two of those. Next, an even better check print. Oh my gosh, just when you thought this was the highlight, there's more. And on the back you have kind of like a firework, blue and tan. Oh, I just love plaids. Mad about plaid, you know, like the saying goes. And then here you have um, like some song lyrics here, dots, stripes. You could cut this apart and use them as like strips of embellishment on other things. You also have stars on the back here. I've used this side mostly in my other projects that I'll show you in a minute. Then you have like country quilts. Somebody's entering this in a contest. Took her two years to make it. And then like a bandana. I really like this too. It's a nice red. It's a really nice red too. Okay. And then this is kind of another quilt. Kind of the patchwork feel. And then the back, a polka dot. Can't go wrong with polka dots. And then with the collection, you also get a full sheet of stickers. And these are fun because some of these are huge. I don't know if you can see this one. And they layer, if you've never used Authentique before, their stickers are interesting because what looks like one big sticker, you could actually take apart and use in layers in different ways. Here's another one I'll show you. Um, this one probably does that too. It doesn't, I was gonna show you something and that didn't work on that one. Where is the one I used? Oh, here's one. So like this USA, you could pull just the USA out or use this whole tag as one sticker. So that's kind of interesting, right? And then they have ones like a tag sticker, different little embellishments and stars, great for card making, perfect for scrapbooking. Glorious, right? Are you so excited? Okay, now let me show you what I've already made because as I said, I order two packages at all times and I have started crafting away. Here's what I made today. First, this little layout. 
it is festive. Patriotic, sparkly, flowers. I, got, I always gotta pick up my, my glue, you know, the glue strings. Um, with this, I used a lot of flowers from 49 and Market. I'll put this along with this paper collection in my description. So you could check that out to purchase any of the things you see here. I use some of the stickers here, see, in different dimensional elements. Flowers, rhinestones, I made my own little banner. The star I cut out with my Cricut, easy peasy. Then I made, oh, just a ton of cards. Cute. Again, 49 and Market flowers, love them. Here's this little pinup card. I added some stickles to those um, die cuts too. Same with this. Stickles is great because especially if most of your card is one cutout, you can do so many things with stickles to just give it some dimension. You could even put rhinestones like within the flowers, things like that. Cuteness, right? This is a fun card I made. This is an easel card. So it stands up like this and I used some Prima flowers there. Lays down flat for mailing. And then inside, I decorated it as well. Cute. And then this card is kind of fun too, I wanted to show you. So, it already amazing, but there's a secret. You can pull this little paper clip and before you open the main card, oh, hello, secret pockets. I love making secret pockets and all of my things. And these I just used with the stickers and then cut out some of the background papers, right? That's a fancy card right there. And then inside, boom, rhinestones. I cut out my own banners, did some ink. So this collection, I think you're gonna have a lot of fun with. The colors are really bright, happy, but they also work with vintage -y elements like the jute cord here, gingham ribbon, basically all the stuff that I already buy. So this was a lot of fun to play with. I hope you enjoy it too. I have a very important question to ask you because we're talking America here, and that is hamburgers or hot dogs? I feel like this is a really tough choice. People rally one of two sides. Please leave me a comment and let me know your preference, hamburger or hot dogs, I would love to know. And subscribe to my channel, ring the bell, check it out, try it out. Let's go make some stuff. Bye.